hello everybody and welcome back. I'm now I've got a, a largest lump of clay here on the wheel. You can't actually see it in the picture because I'm having to film close and I can't get it all in to show you but I've got a reasonable size lump of clay on the wheel here and I'm going to throw these pestles off the off this lump of clay. So first thing is to get the this here, the top the top of it to get that um, a nice sort of curvy shape that's going to marry up with the the mortar, the bowl. Not not the easiest of things to throw on it for. Well, because they're sort of long and thin like this and they can tend to have a mind of their own somewhere. This was slightly thinner in the middle section here. And a little bit fatter at the end. So, I've got a marker, uh, a length marker here. Okay. Right. I'm going to put in a mark there. stainless steel metal kidneys. Now do be careful with these because you can actually cut yourself with them quite nastily. First warning. Now dip it in in the water. What I'm going to do is I'm going to use that to actually cut it off. At the same time as cutting it then holds it and stops it from falling down. So I'm going to push it in only to halfway. It helps to support it you see. And I can hold it, put it over there. Right now Next one. Dee 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 dee. See, just by the way, you just make sure that these are thoroughly dried out before you fire them because we don't generally hollow them out because we want them to be reasonably heavy and you know heavy enough to crush the the garlic or whatever that's in there. So they do actually need to be thoroughly dried out because they're fairly thick bit of clay. So a lot of days out in the sunshine maybe or on top of the wood fire. I've got the wood fire burning today because it's actually colder here today. What cold in Spain does it ever get cold they say? Well I've got news for you it does get cold here in Spain not probably as cold as some places in North America but it does get I mean this morning it was went down to about minus three I know that well minus three is that's we think that's quite cold anyway a bit of frost on the car in fact I couldn't get the car started this morning I've got an old 25 year old diesel Mercedes but uh, the battery, the lights got left on last night for a short while and uh, and then we had a hard sort of, well, comparatively speaking, a hard, hardish sort of frost and uh, this morning the battery just went whoa, 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 oh no. So I had to tow it out and Pull it, and then we got it. We got it started. Hang on, right? Is that length long enough? I just do that. Put that in a little mark there. It just helps to. And then 
just holding it with my left hand and then just putting this in just to halfway like that you see I got it there all right now these later on okay this end here which is the cut off end before they get too too hard I I, I make this nice and round with my my thumb and fingers and, and a, and a um, and a sponge and I and I make this a nice nice rounded end okay and then that's thoroughly dried out okay folks well have a go pestles and mortars no kitchen should be without one very useful item to have and um, maybe a bit of a, a challenge to make but have a go at doing them okay stay with it and keep those comments flowing bye now